welcome back to my youtube channel today we are going to be unboxing the new 13 inch macbook pro 2020 yep you heard me right i said 2020 and i know what you might be thinking you might be saying oh my you just got the macbook air 2019 that macbook air 2019 did not even last for like up to three months it crashed immediately and guys i use this editing software final cut pro x and apparently it could not just take it and the funniest thing is that that macbook air 2019 was giving me signs that it was going to crash but i just ignored number one it was always hanging it was very very slow like i would be editing i could not even edit up to like two minutes of a video without my system getting hot or without me having to restart the system every single time i can imagine how frustrating that would be when you're editing and you keep restarting your system i kept on shutting down and restarting the system every single time i decided that i was going to get myself a macbook pro and of course i waited for the 2020 version to come out before i could finally get it and yeah i got it and the macbook air 2019 is not here so i can't really do a comparison for you guys i actually made a trade i mean macbook is not cheap so i had to make a trade so i traded the macbook air 2019 and i added a little money i got myself the macbook pro 2020 so today we are going to be unboxing oh wait it's the other way around <laughs> we are going to be unboxing this bad boy guys i have had the system in my house for two days now and i haven't touched it but trust me trust me it has been doing me to open it but i was like nah i have to do like an unboxing video here on my channel so and uh, yeah i'm not a tech girl i am not into all those tech stuff so i'm just going to like show you the little i know from laptops and all of that so i'm just going to take off the plastic <laughs> hope you guys can see this yeah brand new oh my god <gasps> finally i'm sorry i'm singing <clears throat> guys plastic is off and <clears throat> Okay, it's off and whew, down. Mm. It smells expensive, guys. Expensive. And I'm just going to take this off and just bring out the system itself and drop it here and show you guys what is also inside the box. It has the power cord, of course, it comes with the power cord. So, this is the power cord, guys. And it has like, i think inside here we have like the apple stickers i don't know if you guys have ever seen the apple stickers before <laughs> of course you guys have seen the apple stickers but let me show you it has the apple stickers right here and it also has the adapter here this is the system this is so light this is why i'm obsessed with macbooks macbooks are always so light or rather the macbook air 2019 that i had was super super light it was way lighter than this actually but it's this is the pro so it's allowed to be heavy i mean guys anything pro is just the best if you are going if you are looking for a system that you would use for your work then i suggest that you always go with the macbook Pro anything from 2016 or 2017 upwards just give you what you want even 2015 self does the work and all and this particular macbook pro is the 512 gig space gray this is the space gray 512 gig i got the one with the biggest space because i have suffered in the hands of space the macbook 20 the macbook air 2019 i was using had limited space so i'm still going to take off the plastic mm. oh my morning god so i just need to open it up uh take this away let's just take this away and yeah it came up by itself just exactly what they said wow guys this is the keyboard here is just it's fresh it's so nice like so i'm just going to let it load oh it's on <laughs> okay okay it's on and it's asking me you know what i'm just going to change the position English is the main language. Press the return key. okay 
Okay, so I have to switch position because I want to set it up and I want you guys to set it up with me Like the video title says so we are just going to set it up right now right now It's asking me if I want to use English as my preferred language and obviously so I'm just going to click on Continue so I'm going to click on my country uh, Nigeria and now it's asking me to connect to my Wi-Fi. So this is the Wi-Fi and I'm just going to click on the Wi-Fi's password. So right now it's asking me if I want to transfer any information from like an old Mac. And since I told you guys before that I traded the old Mac just to get this one. No, I won't be transferring anything. So I'm just going to click on continue. Hey Siri. Hey Siri, open the document folder. Okay, so I finally set up Siri guys. And now I can talk to Siri anytime I want. Guys, I actually did not talk about the touch bar. MacBook Pro from, I think it's from 2019, has this touch bar feature and it is just so amazing. It is not in the MacBook Air at all. It's just in the MacBook so um it has like okay you can unlock the system with a touch id so all i have to do is just pull my finger here so now it's asking me what look do i want light or dark or, or um, auto so i'm just going to go with dark because everybody loves dark mode and yeah continue can i just get into my system already jeez okay setting up your mac hey we are in finally guys we are in god look at this display it is i don't know why they keep bringing this update available thingy for every single person that everybody keeps clicking on remind me tomorrow or try tonight so guys this is the touch bar i was telling you guys about that comes with the new macbook pros or the new MacBook Pro. So basically, you could do whatever you want here. If you're listening to music and you just want to like pause, you could just click on the pause button over there. So basically, this is what it looks like, guys. Like, this is so chic. This is so sleek. This is so slim. This is so beautiful. This space gray color. I love, love this space gray color. I, I was never a big fan of the silver. I love this space gray. And as you can see, guys, this is it. Ooh, so slim guys yeah so guys we have finally come to the end of this video and i hope you guys enjoyed this video like i said before i am not a techie person so i'm sorry if i did not really do justice and i didn't really talk about what the laptop is made of and all those kind of things but all i can say the advice i can give is that if you are looking for a good system for production work for editing work you know heavy a system that can carry like heavy stuff then you should go for the macbook pro anything 2015 upwards is really cool basically that's everything i hope you guys enjoyed this video Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you are new here my name is ihoma Eze, and subscribe to my channel guys and i will see you guys in my next video bye